And Lord, you get the feeling, I know we haven't seen a lot of Stacey Fung play over the years, but the little bits that we have seen is... Oh. Well, we've got you, Mark. Certainly back Felix in a baseline rally. Thought about going on this first one, just for me, could be a little further in if she's going to look to cross. The University of Washington actually up in uh, Seattle, that was uh, Phil Knight of Nike's University. Isn't that you just, Oh, I think he's he's done well, Petros, to get himself into the top hundred. That's all, all, all I know. Gee, that's athletic, isn't it? Well, oh, Petros, very ambitious with the first cross. This is what we saw from him last United Cup, where he wanted to do too much out there, and that's sometimes. Well, it's been a great start for Team Canada. A lot of 15 Ks. A lot of good weather there too to have a lot of tournaments, however. <laughs> well, hand-to-hand -hand combat down here. So dynamic with his movement. He's electric, he's keen. Whatsoever. Team Canada in general just have such good attitudes and approaches to these big matches. I was so impressed by Fernandez and how she behaved the entire match against Zachary. Never gave in, battled away to the very last point. That was sort of my question to you because you look at Canada and they've had, they've had tennis has been strong in the last decade, men's and women's. And you know what it brings to the next generation. And I just interested to see the impact for a country like Team Greece because it's not always just because you have two top ten players that a break back great game yeah, from team Greece and the fact that she lost her serve <laughs> stunning tennis confidence booster for Stacy just get the feeling pitch she's getting a little flat-footed or stuck yeah and that, that can be nerve and of course and Australia had Alexi Popper and Alex Dimonor in our team a good team. But those guys had such success, their trajectory to, to the top was so cool. Oh, he's all over it. Petros City Pass. So active, isn't he? And realised that in the first couple of games he didn't do enough to help his partner out. And since then, he has been everywhere. Oh, it's a 
great comeback. They were down 4 1. Much to the delight of this pro Greek crowd here. It is Team Greece who have snapped up this first set seven games to five. Obviously, things are working with Steph at the moment, and Steph loves playing a lot of matches, which is something that he's going to clearly have to manage. <laughs> he, as I said right at the start of the match, he actually he hits the ball beautifully. He just obviously he gets the most out of his serve that he can he gets good leg drive he, he times the ball particularly on the one-hander off backhand return very nicely you don't just because of Steph you don't win oh go on Stacy That's too good. Yeah, to try and turn this match around, did it a bit more of it in this game, taking the lines away from Tsitsipas. Look at the movement yeah. he's got in that service box. He's everywhere. Yeah. Great pick up on the first volley from NJ Aliassim. It looked like Stacey was thinking about taking it, and then he's had to play that from well underneath the net. Great shot. for Team Greece. With the clean sweep. Three love over Team Canada are safely into the quarterfinals of the United Cup. It's just an excellent match from Petrus Tsitsipas in particular. He really made himself known after they went a breakdown.